Hey everyone, so we are back. I am back with another video. I have to get to work and let's like finish this up. I've been seeing this trend get so popular on TikTok. Makeup by Mary Phillips. She's a makeup artist and there's a makeup technique that's getting really popular and I tried it yesterday and it looked great. Not my style, but I decided to recreate it again because it gave a very like natural look and I actually like it and it's a look it's a vibe on the days that I feel like doing it I'm gonna use these two concealers I bought a dark one and a light one by accident it was too light and the dark one was too dark so mixing it is like the perfect solution and basically you contour and Highlight your face with cream based products first and then apply foundation on top. Oh my god, it's been a while since I filmed, but honestly speaking, I just wasn't feeling it. Like I didn't have motivation and I just been having a lot of like negative I've been having hello focus. Having a lot of like negative energy around me and it was just affecting me and I just wasn't feeling like creative which is really like stupid because I should be able to do what I love to do despite what's happening around me but I just wasn't feeling that um, so here I am forcing myself to film this video okay I'm realizing that I may or may not have messed up a little bit I should have done contour first and then lighter concealer but whatever um i'm using a way lighter concealer just for my um inner corner and over here this best investment ever honestly speaking i was just like it's so thick and nice and creamy I saw a tutorial by Mary Phillips first and she uses very little products but I have problematic skin also my skin has been getting a little bit better and I would love to do a skincare routine but I just am waiting for my skin to clear up a little bit so that you know y'all can actually trust what I say you know instead of me having problematic skin and giving you skincare tips like what Mary Phillips is the makeup artist for Hailey Bieber and Kendall Jenner and she has done other celebrities as well so today my look is inspired by Kendall Jenner this is a shirt that well actually I saw her wearing a similar shirt and I was like I own that I can pull off this look because I can't pull off all of her other looks because I don't have outfits and honestly I don't even want to go and buy more stuff so here we are using what we got I'm gonna use a darker concealer as contour just because I don't have a separate contour stick or liquid contour that I would use so this is a little bit cool toned and not Something that I would warm my face up with. I don't know if she contoured her- Oh yeah, she did contour her nose with this. Hopefully, I don't look- doesn't look too bad. I saw the funniest video on TikTok yesterday and it was about this white girl and she was just crying on she was filming herself crying because she dissolved her lip fillers and she didn't like the way that she looked and i was like this is so ironic because it's like it's a full circle moment it's just like people have been making fun of women of color and the way that we look and the features that we have and then they get older and they get plastic surgery to look like us and it's just like you are now feeling what you made others feel when you were younger does that make sense it was just like really funny and i was like that's so hilarious and i was watching 
this other South Asian creator making a video about her experience her experience growing up in America and going to a school that was predominantly white and everyone making fun of how her lips were big and how her features on her face were and all of this other stuff by the way I'm applying the Maybelline Fit Me foundation on top of this mess it is a full coverage foundation but we are just going to lightly like blend this all in anyways she was talking about her experience being made fun of growing up for her lips and all of her features and now one someone that used to bully her when she was young now has gotten lip fillers <laughs> yeah so that's just really funny i just thought that was like hilarious this is a literally a no makeup makeup look i feel um and that's what most of miss kendall jenner's makeup looks like it's like a no makeup look it's very light contour um she kind of has the same vibe on the in the eye makeup and lips i feel this is my personal opinion i have never seen her wear any crazy colors this is one of those makeup looks that you could pull off if you were like naturally gorgeous you know what i mean so yeah and i feel like kendall jenner is that person who it's her that pulls off the looks you know what i mean like she's pretty and she can wear like minimal makeup and then wear whatever and then just look bomb you know and some of us have to like put in a little extra work um so here we are putting in a little extra work it's like barely there also i haven't really fully figured out this lighting does this work i just look oily Okay, you guys, I bought the e.l.f. brow lift. I don't know how I feel about this look on me. Also, my room is messy, so let's not look at that. And my table is messy. Let's just look at me, okay? I just went on a whole rant about my eyebrows, and I found out that I wasn't even recording. Anyways, so you see how like I just, I just pulled this up and then like shaped them? But here's my issue. It looks so thick because my my eyebrows are so hairy. Because usually girls like when they do this, it's like strands of hair. It just looks like they drew on. And my eyebrows, it literally looks like a mustache on my on the wrong side of my face because of how hair. Look at that. It's so hairy. And I'm just like thinking if I should like pluck out some of my eyebrow hair so that it looks like strands and not like I took a whole crayon and just drew an eyebrow you know what I mean? so I don't know how I feel about this whole like gel eyebrow lift gel situation cause it just looks like what the f <laughs> um yeah I don't know how I feel about this yeah I don't I don't even ew why do I look like that? oh my god one eyebrow is like they don't even look the same okay this is the best i can do i gave up i give up i have to like actually get ready for work i'm just gonna lightly set my face take this brush that i stole from my mother why do i look like that i don't like how i look see this is why i don't like i ha i stopped filming myself for a little bit because i was like i just look too ugly right now that's why there's like huge gaps between all of my videos because i'll upload one and i'll be like ew I can't believe I had the balls to upload my video looking like that because I'm just like, ew. Not in some fishing for compliment type of vibe, but just genuinely I look at myself and I'm like, ew, what the hell is that? Yeah, that's why I haven't uploaded in a while because I just, just wake up and I'm like, ew, you know? Oh my god, I bought this blush palette from e.l.f. and I really like it. There's a lot of colors on there. I wanted to try out lighter colored blush on my face and i'm liking the vibe if i find my blush brush okay i go i'm gonna go with this one the only problem is that it has a little bit of like glitter on it just very lightly i look the same on camera i literally look the same like it literally looks like every other makeup that i do but i know what i did you know what i mean like i know the difference it's like subtle changes to my makeup look that i can spot and not everyone can spot so it 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 works okay now i'm gonna highlight my face not too much like not like the usual harsh highlighter just a really light 
glow, not the usual highlight, not the usual harsh highlight look that I usually go for. Um, I just said highlight like usual, I just said usual twice in that sentence. Cringe. to drench my skin with setting spray. I have third day hair, so it's a little greasy, and I'm going to do my hair the same way she did in this look. This is such a basic like hairstyle. I feel like I've done a variation of this on my channel like four or five times. And I've only ever uploaded like four or five times. <laughs> oh my god, it's the egghead, it's the off duty model, it's the basic greasy hair hairstyle. Anyways, I tried. This is like the best that I could do. I'm just gonna do a regular brown look, the same color that I used to warm up my face. Um, I am going to create like, like a, you know? It's a very light eyeshadow look. I am going to do under my eye as well. Ooh, her blush placement is way more higher than what I just did, so we're gonna do that. Um, that didn't do anything, but it did something to me, to my soul. Just very light, tiny eyeliner. This is my wow. The lighting is so bad. This is the best that I could do. Okay, I'm in my car because I'm getting late for work. I just did my under eye, under eye, or lash, li lips, lipstick, mascara on my lower lash. I added highlight on my inner corner. And this is the finished look. I think I like it. I really do like it. It's a very natural look. There's no nothing harsh going on. And I feel like, like in real life, if you see me, you can see that. Oh yeah, she, like I did do like a little bit of contour and a little bit of blush. It's not harsh enough for the camera to pick up. I like it. I don't know about the lips. I still haven't figured out a different lip look. I always go for the safe brown overlining my lips and then uh, a lighter color in the middle and lip gloss. Also, thank you so much for all the love and support. You guys are the only reason why I actually even pick up my camera and film because the other day I went on TikTok live and I don't do that often anymore um, and people were just like, where's the new video? Okay, not people, like one person was just like, when's the new video coming out? And there was this guy that was just like, when's your new video coming out? And can you do a vlog? As a guy, I'd like to watch vlogs and not makeup videos. And I was like, oh my god, you guys are so sweet. So like the two people that reminded me that I need to get back on YouTube, thank you so much. This is for you. But anyways, I feel like I pulled off the Kendall Jenner look. <laughs> She's such a gorgeous human being. So like any minimal makeup that she does just look so gorgeous on her and um it just looks oily on me like like i literally look like i barely put on makeup which is the look bye